my heart. Well, good morning, everyone. Good morning, baby. <laughs> Sorry, but I slept with my makeup, so my eyes look a little black. But, um, poor baby has a fever. She, she had a fever last night. I woke up, but she kept coughing. She, like, she kept feeling like she was going to wake up. Hi. Hi. Yeah. She kept, I, I kept feeling that she was going to wake up, and when I touched her, she was hot, like, like, red hot. That's how hot she was. So I got up, gave her some medicine. She was crying Hi. a little bit. Yeah. Hi, baby. Hi. <laughs> Hi. Ah. Ah. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So I gave her some medicine. Isn't that right? I gave her some last night, huh? So I gave her medicine. I took off her clothes. She don't have any diapers, so that's why she's naked yeah. under this blanket. But that's crazy. Poor baby, she's still nice and she's still hot from the body. So. Yeah, she hasn't cooled down. She cooled down more than she was last night, but she's still a little hot. Alright, so we're back to the marvelous Eliza. She's nice and pretty and dressed Wee. up. She's playing with her toy. Yeah, so meanwhile she's playing with her toy, I'm going to go ahead and clean up the room as much as possible. So she peed without telling me once more. As you can tell, her little pee stains right there, that little black smudge of a dot. <laughs> <sighs> but it's okay. Somehow, all of the licensed teddy bears that were all up there, because we got tired of them on the bed, somehow made it back on to the bed. As you can tell. <laughs> Goodness gracious. Yes, baby. Okay, we're gonna go buy you some juice. You cannot have regular juice because then you'll it'll make your phlegm act up. So I gotta find her some new pants and she peed in them. So you have new underwear and some new jeans. I think these ones would fit you. Okay, take off your slippers. Can you take off your slippers? Your shoe shoe? Take off your shoe shoe? Let me see.
It's a little tight around her thigh, so I'm gonna have to like do like a little cut. Let me see the move. She has really tiny waist, so I luckily these jeans had a little string to make them tighter. So let's go ahead and do that. Mommy. Yes, baby. <laughs> By the way, for parents, like new parents who didn't know that, like I didn't know this. Like my mother-in-law told me about this because I didn't know about parents having this. So if you don't know either. When you mostly buy kids jeans, even baby like 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 baby ones, like most of the pants in the inside, like so these are regular jeans, right? She's a size three, like it fits her long wise. Sometimes it fits her waist, sometimes it doesn't. But no need to worry. Most of those jeans, including for toddlers, because the lights already is a toddler, have Yeah, have an inside um you want to take off? So most like most pants on the inside they have like a like an adjustment for the waist size. So the lights has a tiny waist. So you can tell it was like like this and now it's this small. So in the inside you look on the side of it, you'll see a button. And then you see a button with the string, you just like undo it and then you can stretch it out. It's like I'll show you. So like you see in the the string it has like little holes. So you just the button is like that keeps it in place so you just stretch it out to you need. like you take it off the button and you stretch it out so like when I was adjusting it, it was on the first one but the longer you stretch it out the tighter the waistline gets so I like to double do it so that way the strings not loose so that way I just like put it like this and it'll be like that like the way you guys saw it so that's pretty cool I didn't know about that remember Delisa's pants when she was when she just turned one her pants will always fall down I'm like oh my goodness like the pants don't fit her but they fit her lengthwise and the other ones fit her too tight but then my mother-in-law she was like oh it had, like she showed me that it had like little adjustable buttons and I was like that's so cool I never knew that <laughs> so for new parents that's a little tip for you guys so I'll show you what I mean if it's her length well I'm pretty sure you guys know what lengthwise means well so like you see what I mean like it's like a perfect fit, like from her. It's literally from her hip to her feet. Like it's a boot cut, so it's supposed to look loose. But then, so you see what I mean? Like you can even adjust it while they're wearing it. So it's just like it fits her good. It's not gonna fall down while she's running. So it's a good fit. So now it fits her waist twice, and you can adjust it from right here. So this is a little adjustable right there. So.
we just got that comb. The Lysa is knocked out. You can't really tell that's her, but she's right there asleep, poor baby. She knocked down the right home, so we're home. I'm home. Uh, it's like 10 and 9, 11, but I already tried this. I recorded it, hopefully. I'll probably record it again with this camera because Bubby wants to try it, so I'm going to make him some. And I'll go ahead and make him some. He said try to make a sweep for him. Hi, baby. So I'll probably re-record it so you guys can see properly in case I can't download the other ones from the phone to the computer. But, um, okay, let's go ahead and do this. I just wanted to let you guys know that we're home. Oh, I'm going to stay up though, making him this and separating the clothes to make it easy for me tomorrow to do laundry. So, that's what I'm going to stay up doing. Let's go make some cappuccino. Alright, so... To that I'm gonna make it in the room. I think he's curious to see how it's made. Because mm -hmm. he's like, you're not gonna do it here? And I'm like, no. But I'm gonna make it in here. So I'm just gonna set up my area on top of the like this play toy thing. Hopefully get some the kids. I hope so. Mochaccino, look at that. He's using my special caffeine queen cup. And that's how much I love him. Let's see if he likes it. I'm Here's the true test. Because I'm a caffeine queen. Yes, he's a caffeine king. Not really, I'm the only caffeine girl right here. So, here you go, baby. Thank you. Uh, it might be like really hot, so. There's no bourbon? No. How is it? That's just good. Yeah? yeah? Really good? Is it like sweet enough for you? Like the vanilla is good because like, the foam, but I don't know about it. Do you mix it? or? It yeah, I already mix the coffee in there. Oh, yeah. And the chocolate. Yeah, it's because he likes sweet. Even the cappuccino is not supposed to be that sweet. So I use the creamer oh, that's just good though. as a substitute instead of the milk. So <laughs> I burned myself up. So that's what I did. So, yeah, young guy, he likes it. Isn't that cool? Oh my goodness, I have my cappuccino machine. Thanks, mom, again. Even though I'm going to pay you back, but thank you for finding this for me. So excited. Oh, and another tip that I saw on YouTube. When you turn it off and you're letting it cool down, you're always supposed to release the last amount of like steam on there. So I'm going to do that right now. So it'll just like pop out all that steam. Like it's disconnected, it's off already, and all that steam is going to pop out like... All that steam. 
Kapitan. Also da ist die. Oh, it's only loud because it's a small ass room. So look at all that steam. And it's only so that it doesn't make your machine like kind of want to pop because of all that steam trapped in there. That's what I said. That's what it read on the on the like caution, and you can see it on YouTube also. So. Is it all that loud? It is loud. There's no steam. What's all this loud? Oh, it's still going on. Yeah, but it's because it's still cooling down. So, like, right now. So, yeah. You know, it's dangerous. You don't want your machine to explode on you, you know? But I'm so happy. It's like a vapor of hot mist, like a little, like a little, uh, what's it called? A, a steam room. <laughs> mm -hmm. That's how it is. Gotta release it, you know? It's cool. It's good. Tell them, it's explain good. to them how it tastes. It's good. Does it? It's good. It's He's good. a horrible reviewer. It's like, if he ever were like somebody to review food, he would just say it's good. It's, it's good. not right. I don't like it, but he wouldn't give you details. So, um, I'm gonna call it a night. I just wanted to show off my new cappuccino machine that my mom got me. So, this is a night. I already told you the license to sleep. So, baby, what do we say? Good night. Good night. I'm not even in this camera. Good night. Good night. Good night. Because <laughs> I'm too short.